welcome to Tabletop Gaming Guild. Tabletop Gaming Guild is all about the experiences and memories of playing tabletop games with friends and families can create. And today we'll be unboxing Encyclopedia, published by Holy Ghetto Games and designed by Eric Dubas and Olivier Mellison. <clears throat> I don't know a lot about Encyclopedia other than it's pretty popular right now and it does combine set collection with worker placement. The rules are nicely laid out lots of images and examples good quality paper for the rule book overall that looks pretty promising so far not terribly long a lot of more just because it looks so longer because of the all the um, images nice thick punch boards it's pretty standard nowadays I rarely see issues with punch boards <coughs> Looks like those are player boards that you're going to be slotting cards into, as well as some currency. Okay, so looks like most, there's a male and female version of all the characters. I wonder if those are like objectives, those seals. Oh, that's interesting. These look like... Yeah, these are token containers. Let me build one of these real quick to show you what they look like. That is a really nice idea. I am surprised that that isn't something that everybody's already doing. Okay, so it looks like this is going to be... A large part of this is going to be card games. So there's going to be a lot of card spots. Yeah, my initial impression is the board seems to serve the primary function of just keeping everything organized for you. Draw bags, nice and big. Hands fit, big hands fit in very nicely. You know, some basic cubes, standard dice, and let's look at some of these cards. First off, we have behavior cards, apparently, is what these are called, and these are for the solo mode. Yeah, that makes sense. And next, we have scoring cards for the solo mode. And then we have lots and lots of animal cards. And I think this is where the core of the game is going to be. Now, the art looks really nice. It's kind of, it's not photographs like a lot of the animal games, but it's, it's high quality art. It looks like the kind of art you would put in, you know, a, you know, a book, uh, an anthropology book. So, suiting the theme, and definitely appealing. And this looks really nice. You know, and, you know, these nature themes have been super popular lately, especially since the release of Wingspan. It seems like nature themes are everywhere, and I'm really enjoying that. And the encyclopedia thing is, theme is something that really caught my interest and something that I think Peter would be like interested in as well so I um, primarily got this thinking of oh this would be a great game to learn and then eventually try and play it with Peter and if you don't know who Peter is you probably are pretty new to the channel or maybe just not into RPGs very much because Peter is the primary reviewer for RPGs on our channel and he also works in a library hence the interest in the theme but that's all the components for Encyclopedia. Looks like a really interesting game. And I can't wait to try this one out. I am still baffled that nobody's thought of putting these uh, punch board trays in a game before. They look really promising. And this game looks great. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check us out on other social media such as Instagram and Facebook. And don't forget to like and subscribe.